Welcome to Anderson Lane for our 30 week update. Thank you guys for stopping by. Please don't forget to like and subscribe down below. Hey guys, how is it going? I just wanted to give you guys a 30 week bump update. Um, <clears throat> this week has been one of those that was kind of stressful because I had my glucose test, my second one, and then I had my doctor's appointment. Everything is good. Past the glucose test, I did have to get poked five times and was there for like four and a half hours. Sorry, the dogs are in here today. Um, and I have a little bruising, a little bruising on my arm. Yeah. Um, that one got poked twice. The other arm got poked three times, but there's no bruising over there. And then <clears throat> when I went to the doctor, uh, everything was good. The baby's turned down now, his head is down and um, measuring right on. I only gained a pound, it's probably due to not eating any complex carbs for a month. Um, but, so everything's looking great. Baby's doing good. He did say that I kind of need to stay on that diet. I don't have to be as strict, which is great. Um, Cause I was kind of crazy strict. So hopefully going into this and finishing out, it should be good. And then he does want to monitor me for diabetes like once a year after this. I don't have diabetes that runs in my family, so I don't think it'll be an issue. I think it just was with the pregnancy, but we'll see. I did have something kind of weird happen this morning though. Like my ab, upper ab is like right below where my rib cage ends. And where your rib cage meets, where it starts to separate. I've been having some tingling in my abs right there. And this morning it was tingling and I went to roll over and I felt like it ripped and it burned really bad. I don't know if that's diastasis recti or your abs tear apart or what it is. So if you guys have ever had something like that happen, please comment down below and let me know what you think it might be. I'm going to talk to my doctor about it, um, but I just didn't want to do it today. Um, other than that, I think we're doing good. Everything's measuring right. The baby's doing great. 10 weeks left, which hopefully means only nine weeks left. My babies tend to come a week early. I'm hoping for that. And then we're good to go. Uh, my feet have started have swollen up. I'm to wearing flip flops only and only these kind. Yeah, when you can see, sorry, my feet are kind of gross right now. But when you can see a line on the side of your feet, that's not where it's supposed to be. And they haven't come down. So usually the rest of this pregnancy, they've swollen up and then overnight they usually go down and they take a couple nights. They're not going down right now. So I think I'm just stuck with it for the rest of the time. Um, anyway, yeah, I think that's it. Thank you guys so much for your, com your comments on the last update video. You made me feel so good. <laughs> I tend to overdo it a lot. Um, that's why my husband's great. He always tells me, you need to go sit down. You have to go sit down. Because I'm like, oh, I'm really not doing that much. But I forget that in pregnancy, sometimes I need to relax a little bit. And I'm not good at that. So thank you all for your sweet comments. I have loved them. They've lifted my day. Um, I go back and read them. They make me happy, make me smile on those days when I'm not feeling good. So thank you guys so much. If this is your first time here, please like and subscribe down below. We love people joining our channel and sharing our life with us. Um, we're grateful for all of you guys. And we'll talk to you again later. Bye.